it's all very well to plant um, exotic species from other parts of the world for economic gain. After all, we've um, brought in Hevia brasiliensis from Brazil, that's a rubber tree, um, the oil palm, as well as uh, what do you call from Africa, um, and also cocoa from um, what do you call it, South America. Um, and now Jeffrey Kitigan wants to bring in uh, guarana or Huarana, as it's uh, pronounced by the Portuguese. And um, this is nothing new. For example, the New Zealanders brought in the Indi the uh, Chinese gooseberries from China and uh, called uh, rebranded it as uh, kiwi fruit. And the Vietnamese have brought in uh, culantro from uh, uh, Central America, as well as uh, the pitaya, and they rebranded it as the dragon fruit. So, to bring in guarana, as long as uh, we don't bring in uh, fungus and other molds and pests together with the species, that's fine. Now, apparently, people have been growing guarana in uh, Malaysia for seven generations in Penang particularly. Um, there are lots of videos on YouTube uh, showing um, a bit of the plantation, the Warana plantation in Penang. And also there's a company that wants to build a factory to process the Warana seeds in uh, Sabah. But what I'm really uh, saddened is that there is a plant native to Malaysia. It's uh, the Buah Melaka. Uh, scientifically, it's called Philanthus emblica. The English uh, common name is Amla. It's also known by the misnomer Indian gooseberry. It's not a gooseberry, so that um, that name shouldn't be used. Uh, Tamils call it Nelikai. And um, in Sanskrit, the, the original name is Amalaki. In fact, it grows wild in Malaysia. In fact, it's treated as a pest. But What's so special about this plant? Uh, just like uh, Huarana is special, it has the most caffeine in the whole of the plant kingdom, two to four times more than um, uh, coffee. Um, Amla has between 18 to 200 times more antioxidant power than blueberries, which uh, used to be the number one spot. So now Amla has the most antioxidants in the whole of the plant kingdom. Why 18 to 200? It depends how you measure and what you measure, what method you use, whether you use uh, dried fruit or fresh fruit or, you know, whatever. Anyway, uh, even at 18 times, which is the most conservative, it is um, much more than blueberries, which is in second place now. Okay, so what um, our Minister for Agriculture and Fruit Industries should do is to consult, if you don't believe uh, what I say, any uh, nutritional biochemists uh, worth uh, their salt in either Frame or the Institute for Medical Research or Mardi. I'm sure they have access to the literature and they can verify what I say. In any case, I've put links um, to what I've said in the video description. So we should start growing um, on a commercial scale. Uh, Buam Laka. Now, Buam Laka is the fruit, yeah, it's not the kueh, eh? nothing to do with the kueh. Okay. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to show your support.